All right, so Aries, let's do an energetic check-in. We're going to make sure the energy within us is matching, you know, the expectations of the things going on outside of us. In order to fix the things outside of us, we got to fix the stuff in us, right? So for you, I don't know, as a collective, we keep getting this nine of wands. Um, it's giving me that like mentally, a lot of us are not really able to kind of like just tap into our own psychic abilities because we all have our own psychic abilities to use. And it's just like, we just stuck in collectively because this keeps coming up with, you know, other signs that I'm doing. Like there's this sense of being stuck, but then there's also because... It's like, we've already had to fight so much because you see this person, he's like, who's next, you know? Who's next? Because this person is strong and they're courageous and they're persistent. But it's just something about this, this card that just keeps popping up. So Aries, I need you to believe in yourself and have the courage to continue whatever it is that you are doing, work, working on, focus on. Some It's something that is really important to you. It's something that's really important to you. So I don't know if you are like building some type of blockage where you're just not letting anybody in or if you are just kind of just like in defense mode. Like, I don't, I don't know. But Aries, it's not a wise energy. Like, we got to make sure that we fighting for the right reasons. It does look like you have a decision to make with this Two of Swords also pop popping up. In the read as well. So this two of swords, this is like you pushing something, somebody away. You have to make a choice about something or somebody, but you're pushing the idea of having to make this choice off. It's like, I don't want to decide. I don't know what I should do. Um, and so I'm just going to close myself off to everything going on around me. I don't want to look at anything. I don't want to think about anything. You're avoiding your emotions when it comes to a particular situation and you having to choose to do or to not do something. It's a difficult choice. It's confusion. You have to let whatever's inside of you come up to see what's really causing you this confusion and you just want to act according to your intuition listen to your intuition your intuition is what is going to guide you the best there's not a person not even me not even anybody else that can help you to answer this decision the way you need to make it except for yourself like you know exactly what you need to do and it's you just really being honest and speaking your truth Right? This is all about speaking your truth, discovering your truth, and having a breakthrough. <laughs>